as above so below and if as above is so below and so below is so above is there something already within us that is synchronistically connected to the heavens without is this impulse this undefinable yearning within us to transcend that is this what the caterpillar feels at and senses just before building its cocoon wait think about this is the impulse this undefinable yearning within us to transcend is this what the caterpillar feels and senses just before building that cocoon just before it transmutes is does the caterpillar know it's a butterfly really does the caterpillar know it's a butterfly or is it doing something on reflex and what are the identifiable the identifiable reflexes of our cocoon making and what are the identifiable reflexes the pure ones not the ones orchestrated but what are the identifiable reflexes of our changing creating the cocoon to become the cosmic butterfly there are certain things going on in us right now that are trying to make us build that cocoon but they are being shut down or being reorchestrated into different behavioral patterns or distracting us to get our lusts going which shuts down the kundalini necessary to raise the present consciousness to that level hmm? Hmm? do you feel that you want to build a cocoon if you are feeling the need to build a cocoon then why are you rejecting or why are you resisting that feeling but then the brother valentine what is the feeling how do i identify the feeling of the cocoon i can't tell you because you may have another escape hatch another escape door altogether different from mine we're going through a door yeah but many of us probably have a whole other way of synchronizing through it but i do know that the dimension above us must be drawn into us we must draw all aspects of our dimension by magnetizing every part of us what i talked about in my in my book of the earth called consciousness accretion by absorbing all energy life energies in this present paradigm to the magnetic core of our being we will draw all that is highest to this level and then by very by the very encompassing of these energies we will be transported to the next dimension immediately scientifically we have to pull the greater parts of the dimensions we wish to go into to create the cocoon from within where the butterfly creates it without we create it within and some of us already started the process some of us have already said listen this physical shell is an illusion i'm tired of decorating the shit i'm tired of having to bathe it wash it clean it and you could go outside on the street and see a bunch of them already start their cocoon or well, you say well damn do i have to go outside on the street get a cup sit down and play a harmonica maybe but it sure means that you have adapted you have not you have adapted to your inevitability and that is that you are greater than what you perceive yourself or have been made to perceive yourself to be and right now you're locked down in that perception so what are you saying what do i go home and do well no we're not going to talk about that i want you to start thinking about the fact that everything you think you know you don't know you've only been regurgitating shit that you've been conditioned to believe is real what have you found out that has essentially touched you from within by yourself what have you touched yourself from within with what have you gone and sought that was instantaneous consciousness and knowledge in the moment not from reading a fucking book what have you come to the knowledge of yourself i told you there is the doer the thinker and the knower when last have you had any contact with your knower you've been too busy with the doer and the thinker the knower has the formula for your escape so with that we're going to cut this for the half time